The second solution was to take many existing vehicles such as the Panzer III and increase their firepower with a larger gun. In this case, the PAC 36 37mm gun was replaced with the KWK 39 50mm gun. In addition, both the Sturmgeschütz III and the Panzer IV had their howitzers replaced with a much longer anti-tank gun in 1941. Few vehicles lacked the space to take this larger gun at that point, giving these vehicles a much improved firepower boost compared to many of the other vehicles. Whilst few of these had been completed in any notable amount by the conclusion of the fighting in France, they were an invaluable asset to face the veritable horde of heavily armoured Soviet tanks. The final solution was to develop an entirely new class of vehicle, the Panzerjager. Meaning tank hunter, the earliest Panzerjagers consisted of a captured Czech 47mm gun being mounted on the hull of a Panzer I Ausführung B, with the turret removed and a large, thin metal shield covering three sides of the gun.